What's up guys, it's How To Cook 101. This is the third part of my series on how to cook. Now sometimes you want eggs really bad, but you don't have those eggs in the fridge. So, like, this right here, this is the best substitute. It works perfectly. Now you want some applesauce, baking powder, just some type of butter and stuff. And then this is just what I like to put on it for some flavor. If you can't see it, it's cinnamon ground. Yeah, it's tasty. Okay, so now one egg is equivalent to a quarter of a cup of applesauce. Oh, hold on, let me get it. Okay. Yeah, you can see this, right? Okay. Right here, that's one quarter of a cup. And then we're going to be making two eggs, so you're going to want two or I guess that's more like half a cup of applesauce. Good enough. Okay. Now, we're done with the applesauce. We're just gonna set that in the background and ignore it. Now, right, for a thicker consistency, you'll want to add some baking powder. Uh, it's half a teaspoon of baking powder for each cup or quarter of a cup of applesauce. So since we put two, we're just gonna put one teaspoon in. Right there, that's one teaspoon. Put it right there. Oh, okay. And now, put it on there. You're going to want to heat it up a little. Just put it on like low. Then you're going to want to add your spray. Make sure like it's nice and like it is right there. Okay. Now, oh yeah. Um, Hold on, I'm going to get myself. Okay, so now we have to wait a little bit. Oh yeah, we can turn it to medium heat now. I don't have the cinnamon brown until my uh, eggs are like halfway done. Otherwise it just doesn't quite work out as nicely. So we're just gonna stir it up a little bit, you know. Like make sure the baking powder and applesauce is combined together. I think I might need to add some more spray. There we go. Now this right here is what you want to see in your pan. This looks just like eggs, guys. Just like them. Okay, there we go. Put it back in the stove. I like to cook my eggs approximately like two to three minutes, so we're just going to round the timer. Now you're going to want to constantly stir them so they don't kind of get burned. Because that if this gets burned, it's not like regular eggs. It's no burn. Okay, so right now I'm going to add ground cinnamon. See it? You see it? Uh, oh, I don't normally add about one tablespoon. Ooh. Actually, we won't use quite a tablespoon. I, I don't have that much left. We'll do like half a tablespoon. Oh, you can smell it. It smells so delicious. Okay, so we're gonna use about half. Just add that in there. Okay, this is the stuff, I promise you. You will never regret, regret using this. Stir it all together. it's complete now it might look a little gross but that's just because you know the cinnamon powder makes it look a little brown now you're gonna want to put it into a bowl or a plate you just ooh, that's delicious. I just want to eat it off my hand. Mm. okay
Okay, so now right there we got that. And are you ready? It's a, oh, I forgot the salt and pepper. Oh, what was I thinking? That was a close call there. Uh, just a little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper. Mix it all together. And it's, it looks a little hot right now, but it's actually not that hot. Like, I can see a little bit of steam, but, you know, that's just the water evaporating. And, mmm, delicious. I could eat it all day. <laughs>